Hi everyone, I'm back with another video and today I'm going to share the uh, door hangers that I altered for the uh, So Crafty Adorable wall hanging for May. And we had to do three door hangers, uh, one in uh, pastel spring like colors, one Americana and one uh, with a sign on it like do not disturb crafting and process or something and um, these are the three hangers I came up with we were supposed to include a pocket with a tag um, I never did that though so me bad but I just found it's such a small space and to me it's the hanger that you want as the decoration not a, not a tag so hopefully I don't get in trouble for that but <laughs> This is um, what I came up with. This is the spring one. And, um, sorry, this is hard to film when your camera's right in front of you. Um, I used the uh, um, butterfly garden paper from Pink Paisley and covered it with that and sanded down the edges. And the back I painted with vintage white paint. And then um, I inked the edges with um, old paper. And I just added a bunch of flowers and Prima Bling and stuff. So I've got um, some Prima and Recollection flowers. And this was a flower I got from um, Iraq from Crystal on YouTube is her YouTube name. And then added some Recollection Bling some Prima Bling and um, a little acetate butterfly and then this Prima candy spray and a Recollections butterfly and then some bling coming from it like a little trail and um, so that's my spring door hanger so like I said so once you put on all the stuff I, I didn't really know how to do a tag so hopefully that's okay without the tags and then the next one was Americana and um, I had this paper in my stash and I painted the back again with vintage uh, white and inked the edges with uh, old paper and I layered these uh, flowers, a silk one and then a paper one and then a glittered star from Recollections and added a little bit of bling and then just layered a bunch of different kinds of flowers and buttons um, and some bling and some more stars and then this is a blue jean flower and then a white flower and then a red flower and some another star and then I ran some different colored um, embroidery thread through the different buttons and that's my Americana one and then the third one is my um, sign one and so then I use the uh, butterfly garden paper again from Pink Paisley and painted the back again with the vintage white and um, I cut out a bird cage and a little bird with the Tim Holtz dies and uh, covered it with the Pink Paisley paper and added some stickles to the paper and a little bling for the bird's eye and then I added some jump rings here to the bottom and these little um, My Road uh, chandelier crystals. And the rings were kind of a silver color and I was able to alcohol ink them. So you just put a little bit of um, alcohol ink in a little baggie and put the rings in there and it'll change the color of them. And then this is a Prima flower and this one as well. And this is another one from that rack um, that I got quite a while ago. And um, then I added one of those metal, metal uh, butterflies from the gardening section at Michael's. And then this is a new punch I got from Stamping Up. Um, it's called the Extra Large Decorative Label. It was in the last mini catalog. And they're going to be coming out with some stamps for this punch in the new um, large catalog. So I'm thinking that this punch will be in there as well in the new catalog and that comes out at the end of June um, beginning of July and then I just took some letter stamps and stamped do not disturb and popped it up as well as the 
the um, bird cage. So these are my three um, altered uh, door hangers. Like I said, hope it's okay. I didn't put a tag in them, but I think they're pretty enough without the tags. And I think the tag would have just took away from the door hanger. So thanks everyone for watching. Check out the swaps over at Your Paper Pantry. Have a great day and bye for now.